Hi, I'm Brittany. And I'm Sarah. And welcome to episode one of our series, Get Sheet Faced. We should probably get our wine so we can get sheet faced. Let's do it. is Whispering Angel because doesn't every basic girl love Whispering Angel? But why do you think that is? Um, I think it's because it looks pretty. The bottle looks really pretty too, which you guys will see. Um, and it just tastes like summer and I miss summer, so. It's just also just deliciousness. And I am rosé all day, especially me too in my bathroom, because why not? Also, another cool thing is that it matches our very new sheet mask. So we just launched on the sheet mask Ready, Set, Refresh, and it's a brightening and resurface mask, and we're gonna show you guys how to use it and how it makes you look so beautiful. What's really great, especially about this one, I think, is that it's a sheet mask system, so it's not just like, oh, you do the mask and then it's over. You kinda get a little bit more mileage out of your mask. So then the first step is the um, ample essence gel. So you just rip the first little section. We've also marked for you one, two, three, you know, foolproof. And you just put the gel all over your skin like this. Um, and I feel like the gel is really nice. It's really cooling. Yeah, it feels really good on your skin. I wish that like I had like a jade roller right now because this is like one of those things that you want to really like push into your skin. But fingers just push real hard. I think I'm just gonna push, you know. Get it in the temples. Just so. really get it in there, guys, because we're gonna be moving on to step two in a minute, which is the sheet mask. So that's like, sheet masks are like my favorite part, honestly. I love throwing on a sheet mask after work, um, after like a long day, and... and this actually comes with two masks inside this packet. So you get the one mask, um, but when you buy it, when you buy it, you get two ma you get two of these systems. So a little bit more mileage again. Um, okay, so this one has like this netted, um, breathable sheet mask. So it's a little bit more I'm gonna get my hair lighter. for this one. Yeah, it's a little lighter than um, the typical sheet mask, which is really nice. Um, sometimes I feel like they feel like they're gonna suffocate you, but. I mean, most times I feel like they don't fit my face because my face is so small, so that's my problem. I actually um, like it when they're a little big because then you can just like fold it under and I feel like you get a little bit of that chin and I actually tend to break out on my jawline mm -hmm. area. Yeah, I always want to be like one of those people that like put on sheet mask on the plane but I feel like I would just look like a crazy person so I try to avoid it at all costs. Everyone kind of looks like a crazy person because it is a serial killer mask. <laughs> it is like the Jason mask from the Friday the 13th movies. I wonder if that was the inspo for it, sheet mask. I think it was. <laughs> it absolutely. If not, let's start that rumor. <laughs> okay, so you leave this on for like 10 minutes, mm -hmm. 10 to 15 minutes. Yeah. Um, so. so while we leave it on, we're just going to chat with you guys um, about our skincare resolutions. Um, can we call them skin illusions? Is that a thing? Let's well, start that too. Let's start that. Starting Hashtag right skin illusions. Solid your skin illusions. <laughs> so I Man, have a why? problem. I have a problem with um, how am I gonna talk with this? I have a problem with leaving my makeup on after like a long night or like on the weekend. So one goal for me is like to take my makeup off no matter how tired I am. I don't know about you, but that's like one thing that's like huge for me. Yeah, and I also, I think we both heard like a lot of dermatologists say that you actually age more when you sleep in your makeup. That's really bad, not only obviously for your skin and clogging pores and things like that, but it's actually bad for aging and you will age faster if you leave your makeup on. So if that's not motivation, I'm not really sure what is. Also like, when you don't take your makeup on, you have to wash your pillowcases over and over again, more than you probably should have to. So, I mean, that should be like another reason to take it off, but I feel like I still do such a horrible job. And that's why I wash my pillowcases like five times a week. Mine is like <laughs> picking. I feel like I really pick my face. Like mm -hmm. you, the, the, um, the magnifying mirror is great because you see all of your imperfections and you can address them, but it's mm -hmm. also terrible because I feel like you see all of your imperfections yep. and you can address them. So, and then you just spend hours addressing them and mm -hmm. addressing them turns into obsessive behavior where yeah. you're just 
you know, picking and making things worse. What really ultimately happens is you end up just like sitting there obsessively and picking and digging and picking and digging and making what an imperfection into like what could turn into a really bad scar. Yeah, I definitely feel you on that. I think that like my last thing that I would say is like drinking more water. Mm. Um, like you were saying earlier, like, you know, when we have like shoot days or just things when you're just busy at work, like you tend to drink so much coffee or like other things. So water needs to be number one. Yeah, and then wine number two. And then wine number two. So tell us your skin illusions down below and we I think it's talk. been like 10 minutes. Has it been 10 minutes? Okay, oh. I think we should do the cream now. Yes. So now you just take it off. Obviously these are disposable. Just, ugh. It feels so good to put it on, but it also feels so good to take it off. Yeah, it feels so refreshed. So then I just, you pat it in. Um, this is actually really loaded with stuff. Sometimes when I feel like I put on the sheet mask, mm -hmm. it's like, what is on it? Is it just water? But yeah. this, you can actually feel that it's ingredient filled. Mm -hmm. um, and then last is the Ceramides cream, which is really great finisher. Um, really just seals in that nutrients and that hydration because you did all the work. You sat there for the 10 minutes. That was hard to do. You drank that half bottle of Whispering <laughs> Angel. That was easy to do. Yeah, I feel like this is such a good system, especially for like a girl's night in. Like you have like this three-step process and you pretty much have covered like your skincare routine at that point. Like with this sheet mask, like has everything for you. So I think that's pretty awesome. Yeah, and you want to seal it in. I mean, that's the whole point of the cream. Like if you did all the work, you want to make sure it's all sealed in there and you get the benefits on like long. And don't forget to rub it into your neck because neck is important. Yeah, someone once told me treat your neck the way you treat your face because it's actually thinner skin. It's mm -hmm. like similar to like your eyelid skin actually. Mm -hmm. So to ignore your neck and not treat your neck as good as you treat your face is, is a huge miss um, because that's like the skin that's gonna be thin and have issues and um, sag maybe a little bit when you're older. So the more you could take care of it now, the better it is. Well guys, I hope you guys enjoy getting sheet face with us and I hope you enjoyed seeing what our new Ready Set Refresh mask was all about. And until next time, cheers. cheers.